welcome back to my channel. I'm here with Navy right now. So I didn't film our morning for this day in the life because I figured I could film a morning routine video for you guys at some point. But I wanna take you guys through the rest of my day. Actually getting ready to all get dressed and go out. We have a couple more days of spring break left and I figured I'd take the kids out to do a little something something. But for right now, me and Navy, just, I'm just sitting here and letting her play. She likes to lay naked. So I figured I'd let her play for a little bit before we head out. Also, before we head out, I wanted to show you guys what I got for Navy's room. So if you're new here, for those that don't know, my daughter's name is Navy Rose. And this company reached out to me and I wasn't quite sure about it at first. I, I don't know, I get kind of skeptical about things like this, but I'm really, really so happy with the product itself. So Rose Forever New York reached out to me and I was looking at their website and I was thinking, what could I do with a really pretty box of roses? They have roses in like a velvet box and then they have this one, which I got, which is their crystal set. And I know the roses technically aren't navy colored. Oh, you love them too, right? They're so pretty, but they're blue and they're rose. Y'all get what I was trying to do here, like play on her name a little bit. So look how beautiful these are. I'm like, I'm actually really, really happy with how gorgeous they look. So I'm thinking about for like right now, I don't know if I want to kind of just set them up like that but i chose the crystal box because it comes like with this little case and actually she got this really gorgeous piece of jewelry from trevor's grandmother and so i've been wanting to have a place to put it and i thought that this was like absolutely perfect for that and other pieces of jewelry that she might get in the future i think she could just have it in here but I am honestly just obsessed. I wouldn't share it with you guys if I didn't honestly like the product. So if you want, I will leave a discount code link in the description box below if you're looking for something like this to kind of like spruce up maybe your nursery or maybe your bathroom or just your room, an office or something. I think the crystal specifically is just such a beautiful touch. But like I said, they have a velvet collection too, which is just as nice. But I love the little addition of the drawer in the crystal collection and this color. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. But they have like lavender and pinks and creams and things like that and red. So you have like an array of options if you choose. But for right now, I think I want to get a shelf to kind of display like her really, really nice things like this rose box. And then I've showed you guys this, her little music box that she got for Christmas. Sitting, oh, you, do y'all hear her? It's sitting up on this shelf right now, which is fine. But but it's kind of like an eclectic kind of piece. I don't know. It's kind of really special, I feel like, even though it's really small and dainty. So I kind of want to create a shelf for like her little special things. And I feel like this and like the rose box and um, maybe something a little more personal from her dad and I, we could put on like a separate shelf. So that's kind of my idea for all of that. But I just wanted to show you guys what I got. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> Are you ready to go out today? Are you ready? Y'all, she loves the outdoors, don't you? Yes, you do. Are you ready? Are you so, so ready? What do you think, you gonna roll over for people? She normally only does this kind of stuff when I'm not filming, so the likelihood of me actually getting it for you guys is not likely. But yeah, uh, let's get dressed and I'll see you guys in just a second. Okay, so the kids and I are off to have a picnic. We're gonna go pick up some food first. Kale wants McDonald's, so I'm going to go get him that, and then I want Jimmy John's. So then we're gonna go pick up my meal and then we're gonna head back to a park. And then after our picnic, I have groceries to pick up. I place an order to pick up around 3 to 4 p.m. So then we're going to go get that. But we're just going to enjoy some time outside. Are you excited, bud? Yep. Good. Hi. <laughs> we haven't had a picnic in a really, really long time. I feel like I've never had one in my life. Well, that's not accurate. You've had many. What? Well, then I just don't remember. I think our last, last our last picnic was last year for Easter. Was it really? When COVID like first hit and we couldn't see anybody for Easter. So we had a picnic at the farm. Me, you, and Daddy and the dogs. I barely remember. 
when I was pregnant and I hadn't even announced that I was pregnant yet to anybody. Now Navy is here with us and I bought her the cutest little Easter dress. I'm so excited. So we're at McDonald's. McDonald's. What do you want, bud? I want six chicken nuggets. Okay. Apples. A Sprite. Yes. All right. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. You as well. Thank you. I love your nails. And thank you very much. And I forgot to order a large water. I'll pay for it if I need to, large but can I get it? Don't worry about it? Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, thank you. One of my nails. Oh, I love him. You love him? <laughs> he made my day. I mean, not like I love daddy, but yes, I love him. I love nice people. Oh. Wait, no. I can't break up with my dad already. <laughs> no, I would never break up with daddy. I love daddy. I know. Mm. <laughs> Thanks, baby. Thank you so much. You're really appreciate it. You're welcome. Have a good one. You as well. Got the food. I get the veggie at Jimmy John's with extra cheese, no tomato. You no, know, the world would just be a more peaceful, happier place if restaurants did not charge for extra cheese. It would be a miracle if they didn't do that. Restaurants and stores. Yeah, like buy one, get one free cheese. Amazing. <laughs> much to do when all I can is thinking about you not doing well don't know where you are cause you're not here it's been way too long if I could lay down beside you I would I would when nothing really matters that's all I played soccer in so long and in the, and so i was running to, towards the ball and she ran and she like tackled me down i did fun fact about me in case you didn't know i actually played soccer in europe for about a month for a u18 usa women's soccer team i was the captain of that team <laughs> well coach of one team i, I have no idea what i team. was a soccer coach um but yeah i played soccer in europe for about a month we won second place in the Gothia Cup in Sweden, and we won first place in the Denmark Cup, I believe it was cool. called, in Denmark. Cool. So, yeah, your mom was kind of a badass. <laughs> no big deal. Yeah, but I kept on taking the ball, so I don't really think You know, I'm, I'm a little slower in my older days, okay? Back yeah, then, she, I was 18. <laughs> but now she's not slow on FIFA, so how does that make any sense? Yeah, I kick his butt on FIFA. I'm sorry. I'm like looking at everything and I'm getting emotional for like what? I don't even know. Like this isn't my first diabetic grocery haul. Like this is stupid. <sighs> Measuring out your kid's food and like telling them like we went out the other day and people were like 
eating pretzels and cookies and stuff as a snack in front of him and he couldn't have it. Okay, I want to show you guys kind of like a run through of the grocery haul. I picked up more almond milk and then milk for kale and applesauce. So I labeled everything for him so he knows, you know, what he can have at certain times and other things like that. So the ones that say main meal only, they are above five grams of carbs so he can only have them for his main meal. So the milk, applesauce, these little gogurts didn't realize we were so low on these. I should have gotten more of those, but here are his freebie snacks, which means he can have these in between his meals. They are less than five carbs. I think they're all like one carb or zero. So he doesn't have to have a shot for these. He cannot have something above five carbs for snacks because then it would require a shot and he can only get his insulin. It has to be like four hours in between each insulin shot if that makes sense so pickles sugar-free jello cheese sticks and then these i got for him to try because it's there's zero carbs in it and i thought it would be like a fun little kind of treat drink for him to have you know was kind of like having a soda but not really he's kind of okay with these we probably won't buy these again they're not his favorite but these i actually bought for me but there are only five grams of carbs, so he can technically have that as a freebie snack, so I saved those for him in case he wants them. He really likes the cinnamon roll ones, which I believe are less carbs than this chocolate one. Okay, wait, quick disclaimer before I continue. I know a lot of this is packaged. I've already had someone come at me for my plastic use. Please understand I'm doing this on my own, and, you know, we have an infant. My son is new to diabetics. If I had the time to home cook every single meal and measure every single little item to calculate his insulin and carbs than I would. With the baby, we have a very short window. I mean like very short window right there, okay? Where we can eat in peace. I'm gonna buy my son what he likes. I cannot spend the time making a brand new meal like I used to because if he says he's going to eat a certain amount of that meal that I made and we've never had it before and I give him the insulin for that amount of food and he takes a bite of it and doesn't like it, I don't know what to do. Either I have to force him to eat something that he really does not want to eat or I have to supplement that meal somehow with like juices and things like that to make up for the amount of carbs and that's just a lot of stress and hassle so i do home cook things that i know he likes for quick calculations so that we can all three actually sit down and enjoy a meal together we have a lot of packaged things here okay so back to what i was saying the salads he loves these he actually hasn't had this one yet but this is caesar salad this one just comes with bacon and i know he loves bacon so i decided to get him two of those but these are the ones he has been eating Caesar salad with chicken. These are only eight grams of carbs. So I save these in one of the frozen meals, which I'll show you in a second. We have movie nights on Friday. And so if he has one of these, which are really low carbs, sometimes he has two, then he can have candy and popcorn, which is a treat for him. He has to stay within like a certain amount of carbs each meal so he can't go all out so when he has one of these which are only eight grams then he could have like 13 pieces of his favorite candy or like nine pieces and like a cup and a half of popcorn he actually he really 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 loves salads so it works out perfectly and then eggs are actually a freebie snack but he doesn't like eggs as much as i try to get him to like them so he has more of an option of things to eat for free he just, he doesn't like them, but those are for me. These are for me. And then I actually didn't feel, finish filling this out. My son just came to me and said he's getting really sleepy. So I have like one more 
rotisserie chicken and like half of the one that I started on. So I'll probably have two of these, but this is just rotisserie chicken, which he can also have whenever and as much as he wants because the chicken's zero carbs, which is perfect. Meats, like deli meats in here. My fridge needs to be cleaned out, so please don't mind the dirtiness of it. But like turkey breast, ham, there's um, hot dogs and more turkey back there. Like that's all very, very low carb. So he can have a bunch of the deli meats and stuff like that. Cheeses, butter is like zero carbs. Cheeses are extremely low carb. So that's also a freebie snack here for him. Cheese sticks. Here are his fast acting carbs. So when his blood sugar is low, he can have 15 grams for free of fast acting carbs. So Capri Sun, and the little cutie oranges are 15 grams and there's some other things like skittles um two starbush or something like that are fast acting carbs so he can have a little treat and then down here so i buy a lot of this stuff like the waffles the frozen french toast sticks the frozen pancakes all on the label like how many carbs for a certain amount so it's just super easy for us in the mornings like okay we know five french toast sticks are they're like 45 grams or something like that 49 or the three pancakes are 49 it's just it's easy pancakes french toast waffles these are all things that i used to make you know from scratch before but that is just an, i like i don't have the time to do that so buying it frozen with a label already on telling me how much carbs it is has been like a real lifesaver so i'm in individual packs as opposed to before i would just like buy the really big bag and we would pour it or whatever these come in separate packs so i know how many carbs are in each pack so we love these and then my son's pretty much obsessed with these frozen meals right here. These are only eight grams of carbs as well. So he also usually saves these for movie nights. And these right here, there's also one that comes with meatballs that he really, really loves. These are higher in carb. They're like 40, yeah, 40 grams. So um, those are usually not saved for movie nights because then he wouldn't get to have like his popcorn and candy and stuff, but he does really like those as well. So here is how I have the like pantry laid out and I labeled stuff for him in here as well. These little bag of individual chips are for main meals only. These are just so much easier than getting like the big bags of the chips because then I have to count, oh, 17 chips, oh, 22 chips are like 20 some carbs. You know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> these game changer. Okay, so I got these. These are freebie snacks as well. Little individual packets of green beans. He loves these. Pork rinds, he actually really loves. And then these um, little wisps. There's Parmesan and there's barbecue. We also really like the Tangy Ranch. You can have like a whole bag of these for like two carbs or something like that. It's insane. So those are really good for him to snack on as well in between meals. These are also just easier as opposed to, again, I bought a big box of cereal for me, which I haven't put in there yet, but it will go in there. But these, you know, have the labels already on them. And again, mac and cheese, individuals, personal label. Here, I make a lot of pasta and rice. So I wrote on these so I remember, you know, how to measure them when I do like make a meal, then I know what these starches are. Got him some carb balanced tortillas. I mean, they're still like 19 grams, I think, but a little lower carb because he loves tacos. So then he can have a little bit more tacos if they're lower carb tortillas, but that's how I kind of have the pantry set up for him and whatnot. So it's just easy for him to read. He knows if it's snack time, he can come in here, grab one of these or something in the fridge. And yeah. Oh, look at those feet. They're dirty. You need a bath tonight. Mm -hmm. Was you in here crying? You in here screaming? Yeah. And now look at you. Oh, that was lovely ah. yeah okay ah. right well look at your face it's covered in drool you need a bath tonight that was disgusting navy and where are your pants <laughs> where'd, you, where'd you go where you seriously honey you couldn't look any chunkier if you wanted to could you drool anymore? What are you doing? <laughs> oh my goodness. I just wiped your mouth. What is going on? What are you doing? 
Is that funny? Oh, that was gross. Yep, now we're definitely taking a bath. Made sure you were all safe. Yeah. Papa sleeping. Gotta be quiet. Hey, right there. Okay, now we're all better, huh? I don't know what she's staring at, but clearly. She, you're being so disrespectful. Like we're trying to talk to people on camera and you're giving them the back of your bald head and that's just rude. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna breastfeed. I'm sorry, who said you? Okay, nobody said you could come up here. That's my boob. Anyway, I think I'm just gonna breastfeed, and since Kale's napping, I think I'll just watch some TV with Miss Navy here. Yeah, that doesn't actually ever really happen. <laughs> so I can't believe we are showing out for YouTube in this day in the life. Like, I can't recall the last time Kale took a nap and that I had time to sit down and like watch my own shows. That really never happens, so. I'm kind of excited right now. You ready to eat or you just want to chill out for a sec? She doesn't seem too hungry, so we might wait before we breastfeed. What do you think? Both of my babies are sleeping right now. Okay, so it's time to eat. I was actually going to make tacos for dinner tonight, but Kale doesn't want tacos. He wants mac and cheese, so I'm going to give him mac and cheese and then some grapes and strawberries. Kale gets one cup of grapes and do not mind my dirty stove. I'm going to clean as soon as all the kids go to sleep. So I know it's messy. We're not doing that right now. A cup of grapes is 16 grams of carbs. And I'm gonna give him a cup of strawberry halves. I believe if I remember correctly, I'll look it up again, but I think a cup of strawberries halved is 12 grams. I'm gonna give him the new ones. I'll finish off these because they're not the best and I'll give him the better newer strawberries. But I'm gonna give him a cup of these. Also, these are the most biggest batch of strawberries I have ever received in my life. Like, look at that. Holy crap. Oh girl, she thick. Turned out about a cup of carrots. And then he'll get a little bit of ranch. Ranch is pretty low carb. I think it's like one gram. So that's going to be Kale's meal, mac and cheese, strawberries, grapes, carrots, and ranch. And then I had some leftover butter rice that I just heated up. And then I'm gonna have some rotisserie chicken and I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put this sauce on it. It's so freaking good, you guys. Oh, this is like my go-to easy meal. Rotisserie chicken with some Parmesan garlic sauce, butter rice, and then I'm gonna put some green beans in the oven here. Y'all hear Navy talking? She's so happy right now. Olive oil, salt, pepper, garlic powder, and onion powder. Y'all, ooh, girl, you don't even smile at me. I go away to cook for 10 minutes, and look what this girl did. Yeah. What do you have to say about yourself? 
You think that's so funny <laughs> up in my bed? <laughs> um, guys, this is not the first time. Not the first oh, time. Uh, you're not allowed on my bed anymore. I'm revoking your privileges because you don't know how to behave up here. So everybody what you have to do each meal. So each meal I have to prick my finger, get a shot, and uh, test my blood. Yes. So you're going to put the cap on and you're going to open this. Grab a blood tester. This is a bummer. And I hit the jackpot. <laughs> Good job, baby. Good job. And then, okay, 88. Turn it to two. Now we need to, yeah, squeeze the air out. Air out. And, it's, and then you just pick a spot to get your shot. All right, so we're going to do a quick little cleanup before we have to give Kayla his final insulin and before I put the kids to bed. I will probably continue cleaning after they go to bed, but Kel's gonna help me for a little bit and she's gonna hang out. Alexa, play today's greatest hits. Next one can be the station today's hits on Amazon Music. <laughs> We're gonna wanna go back. So I told him he could either go to bed or stay up and help me clean. And he chose to help his mama clean. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay guys, we're done. Well, we got a lot done. A lot done. Not everything, but I'm exhausted. Agreed. And so I'm ready for bed. But um, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and thank you so much for your help. You're welcome. Cleaning. I You're really welcome. appreciate it. You're welcome. And um, yeah, hope y'all have a great rest of your week, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. <laughs>